All right, hey everyone, Gratuitous here from itsgratuitous.com. In this video, I wanna to talk to you about my M Audio Oxygen Pro template for FL Studio. So this is only for FL Studio users, okay? So I've been working on this for quite a few years now, and now it is on version three, and I'm really excited to get it out to you. And we're gonna talk about what you all get, okay? So you actually get two templates inside of your package. One is version one, so if you like to use the drum pads for your drums, your claps, all that stuff, this is just version one. It just gets the Oxygen Pro up and running nice and simple. Then over time, I started to release what I call the latest version, and it is the drum pad workflow, okay? So let me just load up the Oxygen Pro here for you to see. So this is version one, all right? And um, whenever you load up the Oxygen Pro, you always wanna make sure you're in preset mode. And I know you can't see it very good, but you just press the preset button, and this will give you a rock solid experience in FL Studio. You can use your keys, you can use your drum pads, etc. But over time, I started to release this other version, which is what I call the drum pad workflow. And I'll load it up right here. As you can see, the drum pads change colors. And so now we can start navigating FL Studio off of the drum pads, because I don't use the drum pads when I make beats. I like to use my keys and the transport buttons. And so we can navigate FL Studio and go to our mouse less. And it's been really, really powerful. I really like this workflow and you don't have to follow it. And that's why I include both. So version one is just the basic gets this Oxygen Pro set up because when I first started with the Oxygen Pro, it was very buggy in FL Studio. The Oxygen Pro help manual was not very helpful. And so the template that you install into the Oxygen Pro preset editor, it just gets you set up, you know, and you're good to go. And then again, just make sure that you are in preset mode. And again, I'll just load up version one there. And so version one is all orange drum pads. You can use the drum pads like normal. You can have your keys, you have your um, transport buttons, you have your different banks, all right? That's version one. And then, like I said, so the latest version, the drum pad layout gives you a really, really cool navigation experience. You can open up plugins, you can change presets. We can do what's called A and B comparison, which is spare state and flip state with these buttons right here. Very, very cool for um, mixing once you start getting, uh, you know, becoming a better producer. And just quickly, here is what the package looks like. So you get the premium templates, you get some MIDI scripts and you get a global link. This is new in version three. And this allows you to get my actual setup right, when it comes to plugins. So let's continue on here. So again, you get two templates, you get version one and you get the latest version for the drum pad workflow and you can switch in between them. You know, you don't, it's, it's not like you're locked into one. And now you also get two MIDI scripts. So the free MIDI script is always required to fix the transport buttons. So what are the transport buttons? That's your stop, your play, your record, your back of bar, your forward of bar and your loop button. And again, not all MIDI keyboards offer the loop button and the Oxygen Pro does. And the default operation for the loop button is usually to switch between song and pattern mode in FL Studio. And that's what the free MIDI script does. So you will always need to use the free MIDI script. And again, that's available for free to download on my website. Uh, I have an Oxygen Pro help area and it talks about how to install all this stuff, okay? Um, okay, so the free MIDI script is free and you need it for version one as well as the latest version. And that is for the transport buttons. And then I've also included a premium MIDI script. And again, that's for the drum pad workflow. So if you wanna do the drum pad workflow, you are gonna be using the template and I'll, I'll show that in the package. So you go to the premium templates, you go version 3.0, and then depending on what model you have. So this does support the mini, the 25, the 49 and the 61. I personally like the, the 49, um, but so you import this and then you also need to install both these MIDI scripts and it's very, very easy. I'll break that down in my help area, okay? Now, the next thing I wanna talk about here is um, the new bonus feature in version 3.0 is my uh, global links. So you actually get my global link file because if you have ever watched my trainings and you see how I get hands-on mixing with certain plugins, you simply install the global link file in FL Studio. And this thing is honestly so valuable. Like I've spent so much time, you know, figuring out these plugins, fine tuning them, tweaking them. Some are set up really complex. Some are set up very, very basic. Um, 
and I don't own tons of plugins. But again, if you take my FL Studio courses and you see me use like Fab Filter, like uh, the, the Pro C2 or uh, Pro Q3, and you see me getting hands on mixing, you get this actual file for that hands on experience. Now, this is a work in progress, which means that I am constantly updating it and tweaking it and fine tuning it. And as I keep releasing new updates to the Oxygen Pro template, uh, I'll just kind of keep that updated. All right. Now, this is my exact plugin setup. So this is super, super valuable that I just want you guys to get a good experience and I'm passing it on to you as for, you know, for free in this template. Right. So if you are already an existing customer, this will be included for you. And inside, I actually give you um, a file of the supported VSTs that I use. Again, I don't use tons of plugins and I always tell you guys it's not wise to own tons of plugins like they're expensive. You have to keep them updated. You have to learn them. And it's just about having a good set of reliable plugins that you like and know really well and you become a much better producer. OK, and that way I don't have to maintain everything. So I like to use FabFilter. You can see the T-Rex Clipper, Nexus Flex. And um, again, you can just open this up in your download package to see the um, plugins that are supported. Um, now, like I said, some some of these plugins are set up really complex, like Fab Filter, because they give a really, really cool hands on workflow experience. Again, all off of this drum pad uh, layout, you know, the knobs, the sliders, all that stuff is going to be set up for you if you have Fab Filter plugins. OK, and then some are set up very, very basic. OK, so in other words, um, when I use this Oxygen Pro for um, with my drum pad layout, this one right here is my volume and it's really, really powerful when you open up a plugin, when you want to start playing your melodies. If one instrument is too quiet, you can quickly adjust your volume right here. And then this one right here is my off and on. All right. And I'll create different training videos in my help area uh, talking about that. OK. All right. So again, this is a bonus feature, my global link, and this is included free. All right. So I hope you enjoy that one. All right, so the next one is um, the help area. So I just want to quickly talk about this and how you access the help area. So if you visit my website, it's gratuitous.com. You just click, click the help area, OK? And then you go to the Oxygen Pro. And then you can see here, um, there's tons and tons of help articles. And I will be creating new videos here uh, teaching you more about the Oxygen Pro, like you can download the MIDI script, how to install the MIDI script, the change log. So we'll go to that one. So the change log is, you know, what's changed over time. As you can see, it's on version three. I'm really, really excited to get this out to you guys. I've worked really hard on it. And again, this is the Oxygen Pro right here. So again, you just visit my website, it's gratuitous.com. Uh, here's the templates. And then um, you can read more about it. You can add it to your cart. Um, here's the change log here as well, if you want to see what's been added. And here's more details, right? Again, this is lifetime access um, when you purchase this product. I'll keep you updated with it, okay? Okay, so again, we have the help area. So again, you visit the change log for latest updates. There's help installation guides, how to use the Oxygen Pro. And again, you can download the free MIDI script, all that stuff. So, you know, I'm trying to keep this very organized for you guys. And um, the free MIDI script is there, but I've also included it in the premium purchase so that all you have to do is just purchase, download it, and then install it. You don't have to go search anywhere online. All right. And um, the last one I have here is just about, you know, just to wrap up about what you all get in your purchase. OK, so what you all get with my M Audio Oxygen Pro template, you get lifetime access to the Oxygen Pro updates. All right. So as you can see, it's on version three. So customers who have purchased on version one, they keep getting these updates and I keep you updated through the email list. So if you're not updated on the email list, well, you, you're not going to know when an update happens, but you can follow me on YouTube or whatever. and you can follow up, you know, you can follow me that way. All right. So you get lifetime access to the to the template um, updates. You can also easily switch between version one and version two at any time. So, for example, again, I'm here on version two um, or if you want, you can easily go back to version one, just like they're going to go all orange. Right. And then, it, you know, so whatever you want to do, you're not locked in. And even if you stop using the M Audio Oxygen Pro, you're not locked into this kind of ecosystem. It's kind of like if you have it, you get a really cool experience. If you don't have it, well, you can go and do your thing, but I'm not locking you in. So it's really, really cool that way. So version one is not being like improved, like I'm not adding anything to it. But if you find a bug or anything, I'll fix it. But 
it seems rock solid. Like this, again, this is version one. I've set it up where it just works good in FL Studio. You can use your drum pads for your kick, your clap, all that stuff. But like I said, I don't use my drum pads for making beats. I use my keys and my transport buttons, as well as my knobs and sliders for like hands-on mixing. And that is where I implemented this new version, which is at the moment, it's, it's um, so again, if you hold down the preset button, it um, you will see it is Grat 3.0 and you just select it and you can see the drum pads change colors and now you can get that uh, experience, all right? Um, okay, and then so the latest version is actively being developed and that is the drum pad workflow, right? New features, improvements, and again, the latest version, like I said, that is my actual workflow, which I'm passing on to you. So there you guys go, that is the M Audio Oxygen Pro. So let's just do a quick recap. So again, if we look at the package, so again, this is everything that you get. And inside I leave you text documents for instructions on like, you know, more about it. Here is the uh, MIDI scripts. So again, if you just have version one, you just need the free MIDI script. If you wanna use the drum pad layout, you need both MIDI scripts. And we simply install this into the hardware folder in FL Studio. Again, just visit my help area and I have in-depth instructions about how to get this set up. And even if you don't have an internet connection, like once you've downloaded it, you can easily come here and read the instructions and I have everything laid out for you. I also have um, version one and version three here for you. And then you, again, you can read about what version to use. So inside of your download package, I have given you all information, but if you want more information, you can just visit my help area for the Oxygen Pro, okay? So again, quick recap, you get two templates included, which these templates import into the M Audio Oxygen Pro preset editor. You can just type that into Google. It is free. You just download it. And then that is a software we use to import templates into our Oxygen Pro. Okay. You get two versions. So version one is just the basic layout where, you know, you just want a basic MIDI keyboard in FL Studio. That's what version one is going to get for you. Just rock solid, just works good in FL Studio. The latest version is for that cool drum pad workflow. And again, you can switch in between them. You're not locked in. And then it comes with two MIDI scripts. So there's the free one where you don't even need to purchase this template at all. Like you could just get the free MIDI script, but you do have to set up the tempo sync to be external. And like I said, if that's kind of over your head, you just want to just get this Oxygen Pro set up and running, then, you know, just use version one with the free MIDI script and you're on your way. Okay, and then again, if you want the drum pad workflow, you're going to need the template as well as both MIDI scripts. So the free one is for the transport buttons. Again, our transport buttons are right here. The stop, play, record, back bar, forward bar, loop button. And then the premium MIDI script is for this really cool uh, drum pad workflow. Okay, so if you have any questions, you feel free to contact me at hi at itsgratuitous.com. I hope you enjoy my M Audio Oxygen Pro template for FL Studio. Um, the drum pad layout, I really, really like. It's been really, really fun. It saved me a lot from going to my mouse. And when I'm making my beats, I can, I can keep my hands up here a lot more. So uh, if you have any questions, you can reach out. And if you purchase, thank you so much for your business. I hope you enjoy your M Audio Oxygen Pro in FL Studio.